fun. All right, come on guys. And your measuring thing. <laughs> I'm gonna eat this pecan. These are so good. It was so easy to make them. Mark. Hey pals, I'm Bjorn, and this is the Cub Kitchen. Cub Kitchen is a show where I do crazy easy recipes in my underwear. Episode 10 of season two, we are doing strawberry spinach salad. So first I gotta talk about my first sponsor, Bearskin Underwear. This is the product here. This is what I'm gonna wear today. The tangerine boxer brief flavor. No, it's not flavored. Tangerine color. Here we go, boom, look at that. They're made of bamboo, which is awesome. Super soft, really breathable. They got the breathable mesh between your legs. So the first thing that we're gonna do today is I'm gonna put these bad boys on. Bearskin.com, check them out, get yourself a pair. Got my bearskin underwears on. All right, pals, doing it. Tangerine box of briefs, full effect. Uh, I gotta also talk about our second sponsor. If you haven't noticed, I got my mustache all done up with my Rides Mustache Wax. Tame that stash, rides that stash. So Rides Wax, one word, on Etsy, go check them out. This is the mustache wax, super awesome stuff. You guys gotta grab some. Yeah, that's all of our sponsors. Just let's get this recipe going. The strawberry spinach salad. <laughs> the strawberry spinach salad, that's it. Let's get it started. So first we gotta go over the tools. This one's got a lot of tools, but they're just like easy stuff that you can find around your house. Tools are knife, cutting board, you need bowls, uh, this spatula, you need whisk, measuring spoons, measuring cup, and on stick, skillet, a really small saucepan, a stove, some parchment paper, and then I'm gonna use this, it doesn't matter, I'm just using a cookie sheet, but it's just gonna be like, laid out on it. We're not baking anything, don't worry. All right, that's all the tools that you need. Now the ingredients, we'll go over a couple of them. First, there are three elements to this salad. First element that we'll go over is the pecan. We're doing candy pecans. You need one cup of pecans, of course, a half cup brown sugar, quarter teaspoon of salt, quarter teaspoon ground cinnamon, and then two tablespoons of water. All right, next thing is the dressing. For the dressing, a half cup of balsamic vinegar, one tablespoon honey, one half cup olive oil, one tablespoon Dijon mustard, and then just uh, salt and pepper. The pepper, it's better if it's fresh cracked, so we're gonna do fresh crack today. That's the dressing ingredients. Now for the rest of the salad part, a quarter of a chopped red onion, pound of sliced strawberries, but it's about a cup. So you're gonna do about a cup of sliced strawberries. 10 ounces of spinach, so a bunch of spinach. It's cotija cheese, you need some of that. I don't have that measured out, cause I just kinda, it's, it's like a garnish. You just are gonna sprinkle it on the top. So I don't know, a handful of cotija cheese. All right, that's all the ingredients. So let's get started on this recipe. First thing we're gonna do are the candied pecans. It's just a basic candied pecan. Your non-stick pan. Take the half cup of brown sugar in there. And then your quarter teaspoon of ground cinnamon, quarter teaspoon salt in the pan. And then the next thing is your two tablespoons of water. One, two. Now, this is where you use this. It, it kind of looks like that when you start. You're gonna heat it on medium until it gets bubbly and you just continue to stir. And then we'll add the pecan. Here we go. You just mix it together so it kind of looks like a little, a little bit like that. Uh, yeah. We're melting the sugar. And once it bubbles, we add one cup, half pecans. All right, so this is what it's gonna look like when it gets all bubbly. So it looks like when you add the pecans. Bubbly. Now when you add the pecans, you wanna shift it around so that they all get nice and coated. And then we're gonna cook it on medium for about three minutes. Set a timer for three minutes. Okay, three cool. minutes until okay. Get your parchment paper ready. Get your parchment ready for when they're done in three minutes. Oh, you guys, these smell so good. I know you're thinking, you're like, Bjorn, candying some pecans, that sounds really complicated. It's not, it takes like five minutes. All right, so three minutes is up. Let's remove, we're gonna remove it from the heat and then transfer them to the parchment paper. All right, this is what they look like when they're done. They're like, mmm, they don't smell like candy. So we're gonna put them on the parchment and then spread them out. This works best with a non-stick pan. You spread them out and then we'll let these cool for 10 minutes until they're not hot. Those are your pecans, those are done. So here's the pecans, cooling. So cool. All right, so now we're gonna do the dressing. That's the first part of the dressing is the balsamic reduction. So take your balsamic vinegar, we're gonna do half cup, reduce it. All right, so half cup. <laughs> In our little tiny guy, 
You're just gonna bring that to boil and then we'll stir it and then turn it way down and, and cook it until it's reduced. So while you're waiting for that to happen, you can chop up red onions. So you got your red onion chopped, cool. And then the next thing you can do is you can chop your strawberries. So make sure to rinse them first. Strawberries are pretty easy to deal with, but my favorite way to do it is I cut the top off and then you have a flat surface so you can set it on your cutting board and you can just slice it. So now you see how that's like flat and then that'll sit and then you just yep, like a gun. Cha. You don't have to make that noise. Strawberry all sliced up. So, got your strawberries done. All right, those are done. It gets real strong in the kitchen when you're doing this reduction. So you gotta turn your fan on, it helps. The balsamic vinegar is boiling. So then you turn it down to a just a little simmer, just a light heat. <laughs> Give it a little stir, and then we'll let it simmer for like two or three minutes, because it's not very much. The next, so we're going to add it to the rest of our dressing. So your mixing bowl, and your measuring thing. <laughs> Olive oil, I like to use extra virgin olive oil for this. Half cup of olive oil. Come on, baby, in there. And I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in my measuring spoon, because I'm about to measure some sticky stuff. One tablespoon of honey in there. And then one tablespoon of Dijon mustard, gives it a nice tang. Okay, that's in there. And then salt and pepper, kind of to taste. Uh, that's good amount of salt. And with this one, if you use fresh cracked pepper, it's gonna be a lot better. I kind of like it spicy, I like a lot of pepper, so. Then you add your reduction. Whisk these items together, and that is your dressing. It's your balsamic dressing. They'll be sep they'll separate, but that's your dressing. And you got everything chopped, so now we assemble it. Super easy. Okay, spinach. So you do a bed of spinach. Spinach. I'm gonna make it really presentable. Red onions, bunch of strawberries, and then the pecans. So you can break these up a little bit more if you want to. I mean, when they're like this, you obviously break them, but here are pecans. And you can save these because they're like, you can just have them like candy. They're just candied. Oh my God, they're so good. They're so easy to make them. All right, these are great for salads. You can put them in like any salad. I gotta be careful because I'm gonna, I'm just gonna sit here and eat these pecans, geez. And then you put your cotija cheese on there. A nice little, the last thing that you do is you drizzle it with the dressing. I like to just use a spoon and do it that way. Right over the top. There it is, you guys. The strawberry spinach salad. I'm gonna spin it, spin the spinach. There it is, all done. All right, I'm gonna take a little bite. Gotta get all the flavors in this bite. Oh my God, it's insane. You guys have to make this recipe. If anything, just make the pecans because they're delicious. Oh my God. That cotija cheese is like perfect for this salad. I was a little nervous about it. Oh my God. Man, I'm just really hungry. Make this salad, you guys. All right, pals. That's it, that is the strawberry spinach salad all done. So first I gotta thank my sponsor, Bearskin Underwear, for providing the wardrobe once again, as usual. Go down to bearskin.com, pick up a pair of these. Uh, definitely go to Etsy, check out Rides Wax, one word. Pick up a tin of the awesome mustache wax, Rides Wax on Etsy, check it out. Make sure and like and subscribe to my channel. Check out my other videos. Please comment on my videos. I wanna hear what you guys have to say. I've been Bjorn with the Cup Kitchen. Thanks, pals, for watching. Bye.